What is up guys? It's time for Dylan back at it again with another crypto video. Thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate all the support. If you're new here, make sure that you smash that subscribe button so that you can stay up to date when I post new crypto videos. Anyway, in today's video, what I want to talk about is Cardano NFTs. I'm super excited about Cardano NFTs because I'm sure you guys are aware Ethereum's price keeps going up. And when Ethereum's price keeps going up, what happens? The gas fees. So I'm sure you guys saw in my last video, I tried to list one of my NFTs on OpenSea and they tried to charge me a $300 gas fee. So no way, that's just, that's too much. It's starting to get out of hand. And because of that, I'm sure a lot of people out there are starting to feel the same way. It's getting out of hand. So if you guys love NFTs and you really don't wanna pay high fees, you have two options, Cardano NFTs, or Solana NFTs. So in today's video, what I wanna do is show you guys all about Cardano NFTs, show you how to set up your own wallet. I'm gonna do the EuroEye wallet because it's really cool. It's just like MetaMask. You can set it up as a, you know, a browser extension with Chrome. And then I'm gonna show you the marketplace, cnft.io, super cool website where you can buy and sell NFTs on Cardano's main network. And then at the very end, of this video, I'm gonna show you a website where you can find brand new NFTs. So make sure that you stick through till the end so that you can see what that website is. Anyway, first things first, let's do a market overview. Head on over to CoinMarketCap to do that. I'll see you there. Alrighty guys, I'm here at CoinMarketCap and I'm gonna try and keep it brief today because there's not much to talk about, but the total global crypto market cap is down not even 1%. So. Like I said, there's really not much to talk about. Ethereum's up like almost 2%. Bitcoin's down almost 2%. And yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, Solana still pumping. Pretty crazy to see. Uh, but really what I wanted to talk about today was, of course, Cardano NFTs. And the reason why is because I'm sure you guys are aware, gas fees on Ethereum's network are absolutely out of this world. You know, I checked again this morning and it's something like $320 that OpenSea or really Ethereum's network wanted to charge me just to transact on the network this morning. So, you know, that's what prompted me to make this video because it's just so crazy to see that to transact on the network, it costs that much money. So I don't think that, you know, something like that is viable for very long. And I personally think, especially since NFTs are so popular, I think that the main NFT market is going to migrate very soon here off of Ethereum's network and go on to either Cardano or Solana. That's because Ethereum will not update fast enough and will not fix these gas fees fast enough. That's just the bottom line. So Cardano down just a little bit today. You know, really it got rocked yesterday. It was almost up to $3 dropping all the way down to $2 and 40 cents. So that pretty much happened yesterday. And we see this big wick right here. It comes down all the way to $2 and 30 cents. So it's just crazy, 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 crazy. But with that being said, NFT space is still doing perfectly fine. But really what I want to talk about right now is this Euro I wallet, right? I'm super interested about these NFTs and the first thing that you have to do is you have to set up a wallet, right? So I decided to go with Eurowide. You can also go with Daedalus. Daedalus is another popular uh, wallet for Cardano that's available, but I decided to go with Eurowide because you're able to get the extension with Chrome. You know, you just come up here, you click right here and it's right here, boom. So there you are, but anyway, if you did want to set this up, what you would do is you'd come here, you'd click download. You click download Chrome. I'll go through it for you guys, right? It come, takes you over here and you right here where it says remove from Chrome, it would say add to Chrome. So then you'd click add to Chrome and boom, it would, it would, you know, take maybe a minute or two. It would download and then you're going to have it available up here where your extensions are. And then you'd click on the extension and it would directly take you to this page right here, the page that we're on right now, which is the main website for, oh, I'm sorry, not this one. It would take you directly here. Boom, for the first time, your first time use, it's gonna take you here. So you have three options, right? You can connect a hardware wallet. So if you have like a Na uh, Ledger Nano or something like that, you can connect it so that you're able to access those funds 
from the URI wallet, which is super awesome. Or you can create a new wallet, which is what we're gonna do. Or like you saw, right, I have my own wallet. If I wanna access this wallet on another computer, what I'm gonna do is use the seed phrase, which is something that we're gonna set up right now, to uh, recover it on another computer. That way my funds are still available there. Uh, because basically all this is doing is just storing your private keys for the cryptos. So that's basically all this is doing. So let's go ahead and click create wallet. So we have two options. Of course, we're going to select Cardano and then we're going to choose create wallet, right? We're going to give it a name, dummy wallet. Boom, the password. Boom. Uh, there, we made a password. So this is the point I was talking about, right? The recovery phrase. So this is your seed phrase. So you want to make sure that you write this down. I'm not going to write it down because this is just a dummy account. I'm not even going to use it, but I'm, I'm going to take a picture. I highly suggest you guys write this down and put it somewhere safe uh, because if you have it on your computer, someone can hack your computer. They get that phrase. They have your funds. It's that simple. So you want to be careful. But anyway, you know, click continue and it's going to give you your, your words. I'm just going to take a picture because, well, like I said, this isn't my real wallet. And then you're going to, you know, enter these in the way that we just saw it. So wrestle. Boom. There we go. Confirm. And there you go, guys. It's literally that simple. Super simple. You now have your very own wallet available right here on your browser so then from here what you're gonna do is you're just gonna come up here right let's just pretend you know close that out we'll open this up open up a new one let's go to your way now that we have it downloaded right <clears throat> we're just opening it up a fresh new instance and as you can see your wallet is now available here right and now from here it's just like a regular wallet on your on your smartphone or Whatever type of wallet that you're accustomed to, it's the same exact thing. Here it'll show your balance, except this one's strictly dealing with Cardano. And then you can see your transaction history. If you want to send what you have in this wallet somewhere, you would just put the wallet address here and put the amount here. Click send. Super, super easy. And then also receive. Super easy, right? So now on your smartphone, if you have Cardano in, you know, Coinbase or Voyager, some type of exchange, you can now send in your Cardano to this wallet. So pretty awesome. I think so, right? So I actually did that part yesterday. I went here and I sent in some Cardano. I sent in 150 Cardano from my main uh, wallet. And basically I'm gonna use this to buy some NFTs. Uh, not right now, but eventually I will show you how to do that. Uh, I will show you when I decide to go buy those NFTs. But right now, what I want to show you, of course, is the marketplace that you're going to go to to actually buy the NFTs. So now that you have your wallet, you're ready to go, you're ready to transact. And of course, you need a website to go buy those NFTs. That is where you find cnft.io. This is your place, your one stop shop for all Cardano NFTs. So here we are, we're on the website. And let me just start by saying this it is not as refined as open sea that is obvious right off the bat you know really all you have is your marketplace boom you click marketplace it takes you here and that's it this is this is what you got right here and then you can sort by price low to high old recent that's pretty much it it's not as refined as open sea and that kind of what scares me a little bit because you're not able to go in and see, oh, who bought this last? How much did they buy it for? Where's all the activity? Which projects are hot? None of that information is available. Uh, you know, as you can see, you click on a project, right? It's not even rendering the image right now, that's fine. But it just gives you this basic information. Um, you know, super, super, super basic. So that's pretty much it with you know, cnft.io, this is pretty much your only shop, you know? And you guys have to keep in mind, NFTs on Cardano's ecosystem are still fairly new. So just keep that in mind going forward because you're not gonna find nearly as many projects on Cardano's ecosystem. It's really just a couple, 
that's that's all you have you don't have a big selection so just keep that in mind but now I've got to show you guys this website I told you I would at the beginning and really this website is super awesome this will be your one-stop shop guys to get information about nfts on cardano's ecosystem and what is that website it's when c nft so when w e n right here at the top you guys can see it right here and i'll make sure to link these in the description so that you guys you know don't get lost and go to a fake website but this website's super cool because it shows you when <laughs> hence the name these nft projects are going to be coming out to dropping this week september 9th stick fricks cardano chameleon september 9th rhino generation so it's super awesome because you know you're able to click on the image of the nft and then it'll show you the website where you can go to and boom these are them right there you can find your projects right here so a super awesome website i'm super excited about this whole industry because like i said ethereum gas fees are freaking crazy and i don't want to deal with them anymore but i'm still super excited about nfts and i want to make sure that i get some exposure before it's too late so it's the best of both worlds and then of course you have to keep in mind cardano is about to release smart contract capability when on the 12th of this month that is literally in a couple days less than a week so when that happens what's going to happen there's going to be an influx of new users to the space and those new users are going to want to see what this ecosystem is capable of one of the first things that they're going to do is look at nfts so i'm super excited about it because seamless integration and the reason why there will be seamless integration is because there will be dApps, decentralized applications which will be possible thanks to smart contracts so i'm super excited to see what the future of cardano nfts holds in store Alrighty guys, that's all I have for you today. If you like this video, found it useful, make sure that you smash that like button, drop a comment down below, and of course, subscribe to the channel. Really helps my channel grow, and it helps with the YouTube algorithm. Anyway, you guys have a beautiful day, beautiful night, wherever you guys are, Dylan is out.